What's going on, YouTube? How is it going? This your girl, Kiki Lee, number one. Yo, hmm. Girls and guys really blow my mind. Everybody I know always like, yo, Kiki, why you wanna never come out? Why you don't want to chill? Because y'all got too much drama going on out there. I can't, why can't I come outside without having to see some drama? Every time, it's always something. Like, y'all have a go out. And mind you, you only went out with a certain few people. So you already know who done put you with something. Like, I go out with my friend. Friend. All of a sudden, I'm hearing my name and all sorts of stuff. Mind you, before I started hanging with this particular person, my name wasn't in nothing. Nothing at all. Because like I just said, I stayed to myself. And I'm sorry, y'all, that I'm playing with my hair a lot. This is the old tray here that I had in my previous video with the purple in it. But I just took the purple out, purple out, because my birthday is coming this week. So I felt like I wanted to look a little more classy. I just put the purple in to try something, but I actually like it with black with a little makeup. But anyway, this person has just stressed me out. Like, I get a cold. Oh, why are you telling people that I'm talking about you, this, damn whatever? I said, first of all, I ain't telling nobody that you was talking about me. I said to particular people I said oh I'm not coming out because every time I come out my name is in something so if that person told you exactly how I told them then I know they didn't say nothing because one they don't even know me you hang out so you just totally just told on yourself why are you telling on yourself hmm what what do you feel like you got to prove to people you ain't got nothing to prove to me but then it's just like, you know, I'm one, if I'm talking to somebody, like, and they start feeling somebody else, fine by me, whatever, we, it just ain't meant to be cool by me. I don't got no problem with it. But this chick, she can't take it. And you two, like they say, don't be smelling yourself. I smell myself. I love me some me. Because if I don't love me some me, ain't nobody else going to love it neither. So, anyway. So, it's this boy. Well, it's a few of them that got to do with this one person. But, it's this one particular story, YouTube. It's this boy. And we both cool with him. But, I noticed that he be using her for her money. That he only want to hang with her when she paying for him to go somewhere. When she paying, when she funding the activities at hand. And yes, I did ask him, why are you using my friend? Why it seem like you only want to go somewhere when she paying for you? Me, you two, I'm old fashioned. I believe you invite me somewhere you should pay. And if you don't feel like paying as a man, we go half. I pay for what I had, and you pay for what you had. So that way ain't no misunderstandings about nothing. Like, we go out. Um, she like, oh, don't worry about it. Just bring what you gonna bring. Whatever the case may be. You don't need no money. I got you. And my mama and my family raised me. If you going somewhere, you always make sure you got at least $10, $20 in your pocket. To make sure you can get from point A where you at to point B, which is home. And if you can't get to your home, get to your family how that could get you home. Like, so, she like, oh, what, you don't trust me with every case, maybe? I'm like, no, want you my friend. I don't want, I don't feel right that you sit here paying for everybody out of your pocket. Like, bitch, you ain't got it like that, and neither do I. So, anyway, I'm sorry, y'all. I know my story is all over the place today, but it's just so much to what happened. So, anyway, I'm like, yeah, so you using my friend for her money. I see you only want to hang out when it's coming out of her pocket. He like, nah, I ain't even like that. But if she gonna pay, why should I stop her? 
What you mean, why should you stop for one? Because you're a man and you are degrading yourself by letting some girl pay for you. And d men, don't get it twisted. Just because I say that, I do not think it's okay for ladies to think that men supposed to pay for everything. Like I said, I'm old fashioned. If you ask me I want a date, then yes, I feel like you should pay. But if we just like, oh yeah, we're going to go out, whatever the case may be, I can pay for my own. If I ain't got no money to pay for my own on whatever may have happened, I'm not going. Even if I know that my that my um expenses is going to be covered. Just because you say that, what happens if something may go down that make you not want to cover my expenses no more? That's like we're going out to eat and I can't cover my expenses. I'm not about to be in the bag washing up dishes. My nails are too freaking precious, and I ain't washing nobody's dishes. Hey, only dishes I wash is my house dishes, and I hate even washing those because I hate sticking my hand in dirty water. But anyway, y'all, so she's like, oh, don't be asking him why, why I do what I do for him and why he let me do what I do for him. I'm like, you know what? You know what, honey? I did what I did. I said what I said because I thought I felt like my friend is being taken to the end of job. They are very bright, bright, intelligent, beautiful girl. Why are you letting this man do this to you? But just like they say, you can lead a dog to the water, but you can't make him drink it. Dog, camel, goat, horse, whatever. Really doesn't matter to me. I can only give you but so much freaking advice on the situation. Ladies, why is it always you want to get into an altercation over a dude? Like they say, there's plenty of fish in the sea. And if you need to do that over a guy you ain't even with, I don't know what to say. I really don't. As I see, my eyes got pretty wide on that situation on that right there because I feel that is, that's despicable. Like, ladies, why can't we be able to tell our friends that they mean is cheap? Like, what is up with that? You tell your friend you her man cheating on her. Bitch, why you in my business? Bitch, why you worried about what we doing? Don't be getting up in my business like that. Don't be worried about what my man doing. If he cheating on me, I find out myself. But then let you not tell your friend that her man was cheating. Then you a bad friend. Then she think y'all doing something together because you ain't let it be known that you seen him cheating. Well, you know what I'm about to start doing? I'm going to start taking pictures and be like, sin, bitch, I didn't say nothing. The picture got a million, million words. How you doing? Hmm. I ain't got time for that no more. Like, Trent, please. I'm like, I love me some me. I sure do. I love me some me. I love me so much because I know it's love me ain't nobody else going to so when I look at her I'm like why and ain't that whole sometimes I used to think oh it was the whole daddy thing and I can't say that because you two I got a daddy a father a pappy it don't matter I call them all the same thing it ain't that because like they say you go look for love in the man that you didn't have with your father on always some issues that they don't have settled with themselves is that it you two is that it is that why this beautiful girl does this to herself let these boys treat her like this like i'm just i was just so disgusted but anyway another story I take her with me to my friend, to my homeboy house, whatever. We wound up staying the night because it got real late. And I didn't feel like getting on no train back home. They live in the boroughs. I live in Long Island. That's a good um, little minute to get home. And mind you, at that time of night, you know the trains are running like dumb slow. But anyway, we spent the night over his house. His friend come over. She wound up doing some, some, some grown folk business with his friend. I didn't say nothing, you know, you know, girls, we talk about it. I don't care what you do. You felt like you wanted to sleep. Girl, you need to get yours off, get yours off. More power to you, honey. I don't knock nobody for doing what they got to do. 
but then after the fact she like oh y'all make such a good couple uh, I like, yeah that's nice but I'm not really trying to rush into nothing like I said before y'all I'm old fashioned I want somebody to woo me if you don't know what woo me you know I want somebody to, to you know I want to go out on a few dates I want to talk on the phone long hours of the night to where we both fall asleep on the phone that, that's how I am I'm just not going to spend the night over your house and just sleep with you because I feel like I may want to partake in some activities. No, sorry. I can restrict myself. I can hold myself back. I don't need to do that. But like I said, the people who do that, I don't like it because everybody does what they do. Do what makes you happy. And what makes me happy is waiting because I didn't like it. I didn't know him like that. But anyway, y'all, she like, oh, y'all will make such a cute couple together. Y'all should really talk. And I'm like, nah, we just talking right now. You know, I don't really want no relationship. We just talking. We'll see how it turn out in the long run. Do y'all, do y'all? Why I found out this girl went to this boy house and, and all of a sudden out of the blue, they go out. And I'm like, girl, I don't want to seem like I'm jealous or anything. And whoever comment on this video, if that's how you feel, that's how you feel. But I'm like, he don't want you for you. He wants you because he know that you're going to give it up to him. He wants you because he know, because he done seen damn. She met my homeboy that night and already slept with him. So why couldn't I get up in the pants? And mind you, he looked way, way, way better than his homeboy. Way better. How you doing? Anyway. So me and her get into a, a big old like argument. We get into no fight. I'm I don't really fight, but we get into a big argument. Why are you so worried about what going my pussy? Why are you so worried? I I I, I said because I did tell somebody to tell her because I didn't want to seem like I was jealous or like I was just telling her that because I was talking to him. No, I told somebody else the situation to tell you because. I felt like if I was to tell you, you would be like, oh, that bitch just mad because I'm with him type shit. Bitch, I don't care. As you see, I'm a big bitch, but I could get a man. And trust and believe, a lot of people who know me know I could get a damn good looking man at that. Not every nigga want a bone. And then again, she was one of them girls which I, like, we not, I wouldn't say we friends now, but I would say we acquaintances. Because she was one of them people that, when she getting around guys, she want to act all different and try to, like, talk about my weight and stuff and all of that. And if you can't tell YouTube, I do have a lazy eye a little bit. Like, if you can see it, I don't really know which way to turn. I do have a lazy eye, YouTube. But I felt like, bitch, that don't give you the right to see and try to talk in front of these niggas about me. But I didn't really pay it no mind because I didn't really know what the true friend was. So that's how I realized, you know what, bitch, you're my acquaintance. You're not my friend. But anyway, y'all, like, this bitch is crazy. I'm trying to watch your back because you want to be sitting here spreading your legs and getting that deal. And you get mad at me. But I'm like, you know what? That's fine by me. Do what you want to do. I don't got to look out for you. You ain't my baby. But anyway, y'all. This is just a little story about, you know, girls and a little drama. And females. This and this. Just know. If anytime you want to hang with a nigga and he don't want to pay. Tell that nigga, me and up, me and up. This is 2011. Like they say, and men, same thing to you. This is 2011. A female should be able to pay her own way, but there are rules on that. And I will get with you, with you on that with my next video. Zeus says. <laughs>